Wow, looks like there's two new couples are setting up a household, equally beautiful, and the same match. They both lived happily, romantically and frequently compliment each other. Soon, the couple got the good news. The wife got pregnant. They are very happy. <laughs> After nine months, the wife have gave birth to a very cute baby. How can they increase the number of their family members? I see trees of green, red roses too, I see them bloom for me and you. And I think to myself, what a wonderful world. Hello everyone, you are now watching DD TV KPM. My name is Harif Sean, and you'll be wondering why was I singing that song, What a Wonderful World, right? Why? Because today we will be learning level two, science subject. And of course, science is about the world, it's our daily lives and very interesting, definitely. And of course, you have already seen the profile of the teacher who'll be with us. And she is Miss Devi Anak Perempuan Govinda Sami, Guru Cemelang Science from Sekolah Kebangsaan Dua Taman Selayang Batu Kiri. Selango. Hi, Teacher Devi. Hi. How are you today? I'm good. Are Thank you, you feeling wonderful? Just like the song yes, that I was singing? Yes, I am. <laughs> Just very beautiful, you say. I, I didn't, uh, uh, what we call that, I was like, wow, you can sing that song. <laughs> so very good, very I, nice. I, I do try, I do try. <laughs> and of course, uh, Teacher Devi, today it's not just the both of us. We do have other pupils joining us online. Yes, honey. We have it? our friends Right, so should here. we have a look at our pupils? Where are all of you? Are you all as excited with us today? Do we see our pupils and give us a wave of hands? Ah, uh, there they are. Hello, everyone. If you could help us to introduce them. Yes, uh, we have uh, Mama Ishad from uh, SN Monica Sabah Sandakan, Shamilia Nair from uh, SK St. Mary uh, KL, and we have Iris Umaira from SK2 Taman Selayang, Gombak Selangor, and we have Aku Ryan from Sekolah Rendah uh, Setia Budi, Gombak Selangor. Yes. Wonderful. Hello, my friends. Hello. So you're all very excited to learn science today. And definitely, we are still wondering, what are we going to learn? If you can tell us, Teacher David. Yes, so today we are going to learn about human reproduction. Oh, that's yeah. very interesting. We are Hence going why to learn about that. We see a lot of these babies yeah, on the you table. You can see the title also shown there. Yes, right? that's right. Yeah, yeah. So this is the topic for today, human re reproduction. Okay, yep. if you can share with us as well, what are we going to achieve yep. at the end of our lesson? Yes, Anif. Today we are going to, the learning objective for today is uh, 2.1.1, describe the functions of male and female reproductive organs. And 2.1.2, uh, explain the process of human fertilization until the baby is born. And 2.1.3, provide reasoning on the importance of reproduction to humans. Oh, that's it's very what? important. Yes, I agree with you. Very important. Hence, at the end of the lesson, we'll be able to understand and remember the functions of male and female, female. reproductive exactly, organs. Exactly, exactly. So they'll be quite different, I'm sure. Of course, obviously it's <laughs> different. Okay. Yes. May I uh, they should know what how what is the difference and they will know what are the importance uh, of a reproduction. Exactly. And yes. also we'll be understanding the process of human fertilization. Yes, yes. Where Mostly. do we come from? Yeah. Isn't it? Yes. Until until we are born. Always they have a question about how yes. come I born? From where I come out, right? Exactly. Uh, I think that's, that's a thing. very important question as well. And of course, lastly, we would be able to understand the importance 
of the human reproduction yes. system. Yes, Anif. Yeah. Right, very interesting. And I'm sure all of us have a lot of questions. We're all very energetic, very keen to learn this. And I'm sure my friends online as well, I'm seeing all the beautiful smiling faces. They're all very excited to learn today. Exactly. They look uh, okay, look gorgeous and handsome out there. <laughs> yeah, they are. They are definitely. So before we fully start with our lesson, we're going to take a short break. And maybe my friends at home, you might still want to continue practice singing because we might have a song right at the end yes. okay so make sure you don't go anywhere practice your voices practice your vocals because we're going to take a short break and always stay tuned with us on D-Day TV KPM KPM. You are back with us on Level 2 Slot on DDAT TV KPM. And today we are learning Science Dual Language Program DLP. And of course, with me is Teacher Davy, who's going to be teaching us on the human reproduction. Very interesting. And yes. I guess we'll be focusing on learning the organs in the reproductive system this time. Yes, and if we are going to learn about the human reproductive organs, right. uh, which are male and female organs, so they are different, right? right. So let us go to the slides here. Sure. Okay. Uh, we are looking at the male reproductive organs, uh, where uh, we can see uh, the testes and penis. And we go to next is male reproductive organs and its function. I mean, uh, what is testis? Okay, the testis, the function is the organ that produces sperms, and the penis, the, uh, the function is transfers sperms into the female reproductive organs. Okay? Right. All right, we go to the next, it's female reproductive organ. So in the female reproductive organ, there are four uh, things that they, they should know. There are uterus, fallopian tube, vagina and ovary. Okay, now we are going to do, uh, see what are the functions these organs to the female reproductive, all right? Yeah, next uh, we are going to see this. This is the function. Okay, the function is a place uh, for embryo to grow is uterus and the ovary is the function. We can see place which the ovum or eggs is produced every month. And we can see fallopian tube, the function is placed for fertilization to occur between ovum and sperm. And vagina, uh, the function is receive sperms from the penis. Okay, these are the functions of female reproductive organs. Right. So I hope uh, the students, uh, the kids outside there, uh, at home, they could understand what are the functions and of course the part of the organs. And this is a very important for them to understand this topic. I agree okay. with you, yes. Teacher Davies. So, yeah, and uh, since we have learned this topic, okay, this title, uh, let us ask our students out there. Right. We have uh, four friends there, right? Yes, we so do. So maybe we can ask them uh, what are the functions of those organs there. Ah, okay. Right. Shall we go to the students sure. out there? Sure. So our four okay. pupils. Yeah, we have four pupils out there. Okay. Uh, let us ask. Who want to tell about uh, the function of testes? Ah, raise Anyone? your hand. Oh, okay. Oh, so very we have good. Ishad. Ishad. Okay, Ishad. Could you please tell me what is the function of testes? Yes, teacher. The function of the testes is the organ that produces sperms. Wow, ah. very good. Is that an accurate answer? Exactly. Teacher it's very, very accurate. Well done. And well done, uh, Ishad. Okay, that's good. Okay, we go to the next. Sure. Okay, uh, we are going to ask uh, any one of you, okay? Could you please tell me what is the function of penis? What is the function? Wow, oh. Ryan. Yes, Ryan. What is the function of penis, Ryan? Yes, teacher. The function of the penis is to transfer the sperms into the female reproductive organ. Oh, ah. wow. That's good. Okay, that's very good. 
uh, honey, we can see they can understand what is the function. These yes. two are male reproductive organs. That's right. Okay, well these done are to our two people. Yes, yes, congrats. Okay, we go to the another two more I'm sure. going to ask is, uh, what are the function of uh, ovary? Who want to tell about the function? Yeah, Shamelia. What is the function of ovary, Shamelia? Yes, teacher. The function of the ovary is to produce eggs or ova every month. Mm. Wow, that's good, good. Okay, that's great, uh, Hanif. At least, uh, actually, they should know that uh, the function of ovary, it produces eggs. Every month, there's eggs that produce by yeah. uh, uh, female reproductive organs. That okay? is right. Okay, right. right. We go to the next. Um, we want to know the function of vagina, okay? Yeah. Ah. Wow. Iris. <laughs> yes, Iris. Could you please tell me what's the function of vagina, Iris? Yes, teacher. A vagina is a channel that receives sperm from the penis. Ah, is, wow. that a, is that an accurate answer, teacher Iris? Yes, yes. Well done. Well done, Iris. That's great. Okay, that's the functions and their... Uh, what, I'm sorry, that's the organs and their functions that, that they have learned just now. Wow. Okay. Well so, done. yeah. Do, do we give them marks? Do we give them yeah, stars? Please, Did you can you give them the reward for them? Right. I so think uh, four of them uh, managed to answer. All of them managed to answer. So, yes. all of you, uh, you are getting a nice huge thumbs up here. One for Iris. Uh, this is Iris Umaira, yes, right? Yes, Umaira. Iris Umaira. Okay. So, we have Irsha getting another thumbs up there. Yes. And Shamilia as well. Shamilia. A thumbs up. And yes. of course, Ryan, you yep. answered very yes, accurately. Yes, well done so, for wow. you. Managed so, to get the reward. Okay, yes. four of them, all right? So uh, later we see how many of you, who is the winner for the reward for today, right? Ah, uh, who so got the most thumb up today? True, <laughs> everyone's going to pay attention. I'm sure my friends at home are also paying attention. Uh, yes, yes, hopefully. <laughs> so they can focus whatever uh, we are doing here. Okay. All right, so let us go to the next part. Right. So I need your help, Anif. Sure. So uh, maybe we can ask anyone out there, uh, our pupils, uh, four of them. So maybe they can tell me. Uh, we just do some assessment here uh -huh. where they have to uh, fill in the blanks. I mean, uh, just match. Okay, what are the organs? What are the function here? Right. So we have two here. Okay, maybe I can ask. Uh, Anyone, maybe I can uh, mention one of them. Ryan, could you please tell me what is the uh, picture here? Is it male reproductive organs or female reproductive organs? Male. Male, that's, male that's good. Well, well done. done. Ryan. Well, well done. done, Ryan. Okay, now we're going to ask this. Of course, this is male, this is female, right? <laughs> so. I'm yes. not going to ask you that question. <laughs> okay, so uh, Abang Hanif will help you all uh, to put in the answer. So I need any one of you, could you please tell me what is P here? What is the organ P here? Uh, what is P for the male reproductive organ? Yes, reprodu well, male reproductive organ. Right. What Who is P here? Can we see a raise of hand? Raise up your hand, anyone? Oh, uh, you got a volunteer. Ishad, okay, Ishad, what organ is this? What uh, organ is this? The testis. Testis. Is that right? Yes. Is well done, Isha. Okay, Very so good. I will put it here. Here, here. That's right. Yes. Okay, so organ is testis. Testis. Okay. Uh -huh. Maybe uh, any of uh, our friend there, could you tell me what is the function of P? Since uh, Isha say it's a testis, who want to tell me what is the function of uh, testis here? Come on. Do Anyone? Yes, oh, okay. Shamelia. Wow, Shamelia. Yes, Shamelia. What is the function of testes? The function of the testes is to produce sperm. Oh, okay, right? the organ that produces sperms. Okay. That's the answer. The organ that produces sperms, right? Yes. Is that an accurate answer, Teacher yes. Devi? Hmm. Yes. So, Hanif, what do you think? Is this transform sperms into the female reproductive organs or organs that produce sperms? I think if I recall back, the test is, is to produce sperm. So this is right. This yes. is right. Good job, Shamilia. Good Shamilia. job, Shamilia. Well done. Okay, well done. that's good. Okay, now we go to the second one. There's another organ that mm. in our male reproductive organs. So uh, could you please, anyone, okay? Anyone uh, can raise your hand who want to try for the Q. What is the Q here? Oh, yes, we have a volunteer. Who's that? Oh, yeah. Ryan. Ryan. Oh, yes, Ryan. 
What is the organ we are showing at Q then? Penis. Penis. Ah, ah. Okay, so we'll take that. Wow, very good. Well done. Okay. Well done, Ryan. Well done, Ryan. Okay. Well done, Ryan. That's and I'm nice. sure your next question would be, what is the function yeah, yes. of organ Q? Is that right, yes, Mr. David? Yes, huh? Anif. Okay, let us go to anyone, volunteer, to answer what the function of pen is. Anyone? Hmm. Come on, think. I'm think sure about you it. Know this. Someone is thinking. Ishwar ah. is thinking. Oh, what okay. is that? Function. Come on. Ah. Okay, wow. we've got a volunteer. Shamelia again. Shamelia again. Okay. I think you need to give the reward as well, right? Okay. Okay, Shamelia, what is the function of Q? The function of penis is to transfer sperm into the vagina. Wow. Is that right? Yes. Wow. But here we just put uh, into the female reproductive organ. That's good. That's good. That's, That's good. good. Well yes. done. So I think we can go to the reward there yes. before we go to the next For all question. the amazing and accurate and answers. And I saw Shamelia, she did twice. She did twice? So yeah. Two she thumbs managed up to answer Shamelia? twice. Two thumbs up for her. Okay. So we're giving two to Shamelia right uh, now. Yes. And Ishat one. Ishat is getting one. Ryan good one. Good job. Okay. And, and Ryan, Ryan yes. would be one. Thumbs wow. up. Wow. Okay. Now, who's leading now? Okay. Shamila is leading right now, but I'm sure everyone's going to catch up. And Iris is also going to try more. <laughs> try more. And you know what? We have more questions. Yes. You more may try right after now. this. Right. You, you can get more reward after this. Okay. Let us go to the next question. Okay, we have labelled as W, X, Y and Z. This is obviously it's a female reproductive uh, system. And I want you to tell me, what is labelled as W here? Hmm, Maybe w. you call, uh, you all can help uh, Abang Hanif here. Hmm. Yes, Iris raised her hand. Okay, yes, Iris. Iris, Umaira. What is W there? Uterus. Uterus. The uterus, is that right, Teacher ah, David? So yes, wow. correct answer. Well oh, done. Oh, she's catching up with the marks yeah, here. Yeah, she already knows. Oh, she's at back, right? All right, well we done. go to the next. What show as, uh, what is labelled as X there? X, huh? Anyone? Raise hmm. your hand, please. Ah, so we have someone. Oh, I think ah, I, we Ishar. saw Ishar first. Okay, our friend Ishar. Yes, Ishar. What is X, Ishar? Ovari. Owari. Okay. Okay. Very good. Well okay. done, Ishan. That's a good job. Okay. We go to the next. Maybe hmm. we can uh, we can have a uh, two reward we have given to Iris and uh, Ishan. Ishan. Okay. okay we going to another two more to label here. Right. Okay. Let us ask who want to try for the Y. Who what want to try? Why? Maybe you can raise your hand if you want to try. What is Y here? So why up is here. Over it's showing here. up here. Huh, what is Y? Do I see anyone raising? Anyone? Okay, we do see someone. Is that Shamilia? Yeah, Shamilia again. Right. Yeah, Shamilia. What is Y then? Fallopian tube. Fallopian oh. tube. Well oh. done, Shamilia. Good job, Shamilia. Good job. Okay, we go to the last but not the least. What is Z? What is the label as Z there? Yes, Ryan. Oh, I'm closing the answer. Are you just close? Yes, Ryan. Vagina. What's that? Ah, is that right? Ooh, oh, yes, Ryan. Vagina is well the okay. answer. Yes. So they managed to answer all the label, everything that I have prepared here. That's right. I mean, right. they could understand this topic. I mean, uh, the organs and the function of male and female reproductive organs. Okay, well done. So we're going to give one more thumbs up to Shamelia and one thumbs up to Ryan. Yes. Okay. Yes, so please. let me put more marks here while everyone is catching up. So Shamelia has four now and Ryan has three. Wow, so this, these are all huge thumbs up to all of you. Yeah. Good job in really well paying done. attention, putting a lot of focus and understanding. What well, we're going to take a short break because we have more thumbs up to give you later. Make sure you continue to stay tuned with us on DDA TV KPM. KPM. 
And we are back on Didet TV. KPM now is a level two slot, and we are learning science dual language program DLP. And what are we learning to do? Definitely, it's about the human reproduction. Hmm, that's very interesting. And you see a lot of babies there, and you might be wondering. Where do babies come from? Isn't it, Teacher Davy? Yes, Hanif. We are going to learn from where the babies all come from, right? Ah, are we going so to learn about... So, do you know that? Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. I'm That's not going good. to say. <laughs> I will let you do it. All right. Let me go through the slides. Okay. So, let us, the friends outside there at home can learn what is the process, what are the process of fertilization. Right. Okay. Before that, I want to tell you that uh, there are five steps in human fertilization. There are five steps. Five steps. Eh? Yes, there are five steps. They should know about uh, these five steps. Right. So then only we will get a baby at last. Ah, ah. Okay. Very interesting. I'm curious, what are those five steps? Okay. Let us go through the slides. Okay. The first step. Okay. The fertilization process, the penis of a male parent transfers sperm into the vagina of a female parent. Oh. So this is the what happens first step. Okay, right. that uh, the, sh the people just now they learn about the penis. Okay, uh, the male reproductive organ, right? So this penis is male reproductive organ. Right. So where uh, the male parent transfers sperm into the vagina of female parent. Mm. Okay, they must understand this one only happened once they got married. After they get After married. After they got married. Right. Okay. So, so that I hope those are outside there I could understand yes. what I mean here. Okay. Let us go to the next step. Okay. The fertilization process for the next step. Second step is okay. Sperm swims towards the ovum using their tails. Sperms has tails. Oh. Okay. Yes. Interesting. So, yeah. So later on, uh, we have a video about it. We right. will watch the video. So how it swimming. goes swim. So yes. It looks like tail. a tadpole. Ah, ah right. More right, or less right. like a tadpole. So, and then only one sperm will fuse with an ovum. Ovum means the egg. The egg. They're produced by the female, uh, you know, ovary, right? right ah, the right. part just now we learn about ovary. So they will produce, ovary will produce the ovum. And that we call eggs. Then uh, the oat. The fusion is known as fertilization. When it's fused into with the ovum, that's what we call fertilization. Oh, so that is fertilization. Yes. When one sperm fuse with one, one ovum, ovum, and yes. that's the fertilization yeah, exactly. process. Exactly. Oh, very interesting. good. Very good, Ani. I hope our friends outside there also as like you, they could uh -huh. understand this. This place take place in the fallopian tube. Okay, you should understand this. Fallopian tube at where? Philippian tube. Is it male or uh, female reproductive organ? Hmm. As I recall, it must be in the female reproductive organ. Very good. Because, How do you know that? Because I know in male reproductive uh, organs, there are two, the testes and the penis. Female, they are vagina, uterus, fallopian tube, ovary. Did I miss anything? Wow. Oh, that's Did great, you know? well done, Anif. <laughs> wow, that means I believe that uh, the students out there, they, uh, they, can, they could understand like you. I'm sure so that I'm so can. happy and as long as you can understand. That means my friends out there also, they could understand this very yes. well. Okay, we go to the third step. Okay, the third step is the ovum ha that has been fertilized. Just now we talk about the fertilization, right? Once it's fertilized by a sperm, it's known as a zygote. A zygote. Yeah, you, they should uh, remember the terms here. So that's a zygote. So right. once it's fertilized, it's named as a zygote. Ah, we call it as a zygote. Okay. Not the a zy baby yet. No, 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 not no, not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. Okay. It's just this stage. We are, if you see the stage, the zygote, where the zygote divides itself uh, and forms multiple cells known as the embryo. Ah. The zygote change into embryo. After it divided into cell right. many stages. So as they grow, so from yeah, zygote, it grows a bit into an embryo. embryo. Yeah. Right. Yes, very good. Okay, now we go to the fourth step. Okay, fertilization process. Okay, where we can see the picture that I've shown here. Okay, the uterus. Uh, we can see the embryo, an embryo develops in the uterus of the mother to form the fetus. Oh. Oh, there's another for, uh, terms they should understand. First, we learn about zygote, zygote. embryo, embryo, and the fetus. Fetus. Ah, very interesting. Yes. 
This is the one they should know. These are the terms they should remember during the fertilization. Okay. Okay. So uh, when the fetus remains in the uterus of the mother uh, for about how many months you think? I think for about nine months. Wow, that's great. Right. <laughs> Good answer, Anif. Okay, after about nine months, until the organs are completely developed. It will completely develop. What do you think? When it's completely developed, what is there? If the fetus has been completely developed, must be a baby. Yes, ah. that's good. That's good. Okay, good Cute job, honey. baby. Yes, good job. Hi, Ishad also clapping for you. <laughs> Thank you, Ishad. <laughs> okay, so this is the fourth step. Okay, we're going to fifth. Hmm. Okay, the fifth step is after about nine months, just now you said, right? The mother gives birth to the fetus to the vagina. The fetus is known as a baby, as you say. Now said, it's known now. as a baby. Yes. Oh, so after yeah. nine months, the mother will deliver the baby. Yep. Right. Yes. Maybe we can go to one video okay. uh, regarding the fertilization. So we can uh, ask, play we to ask them to watch the video now. Okay. So we're going to have a short video for you to understand further about the fertilization yeah. process. Yes, yes. Okay, I let's mean. watch this video together. We're going to pay full attention. Process of human fertilization until birth. The female reproduction organs are vagina, uterus, fallopian tube, and also ovary. This is a sperm. Penis of a male parent transfers sperm into the vagina of female parent. Sperm swim towards the ovum using their tails. Only one sperm will fuse with an ovum. The fusion is known as fertilization. This takes place in the fallopian tube. The ovum that has been fertilized by the sperm is known as a zygote. The zygote divides itself and forms multiple cells known as the embryo. The embryo develops in the uterus of the mother to form the fetus. The fetus remains in the uterus of a mother for about nine months until its organs are completely developed. After about nine months, the mother gives birth to the fetus through the vagina. The fetus now known as the baby. There you go. So that's where babies come from. Very interesting. And from that video, Teacher Devi, I think we had uh, a further understanding about the organs. Yes, the and the fertil organs. fertilization process and as well. And the fertilization process. So there are five uh, steps, steps. Uh, in the fertilization process, yes. right? Yes. Ooh, I don't think I will mention it now because I think we can test our friends later. Yes. Of course. Okay, now, uh, before we test our friends, maybe you can uh, tell me, uh, maybe Hanif could uh, try to tell me what are the terms I asked you to remember just ah, now. The terms that you asked, was it the one after fertilization? Yes, okay. no, during the five steps, the okay. terms that are certain terms I asked to rem remember. Okay. What I'm trying think? to re I remember zygote. Ah, yes. <laughs> remember, yes, that's great. I remember Again, zygote. Next. There's, there was also embryo. Uh -huh. And then it turns into a fetus. And then we have a cute little baby. Yes, that's yes. great. Okay, now, now we can ask our friends uh, to try out some questions here. Ah, uh. so my friends at home, our pupils at home, so are you ready to be tested by Teacher Davy? Uh, okay, so what okay. questions oh, do we have? Oh, yeah, they are ready. Okay, let us go. Go to this question here. Okay. Maybe they can label it. 
Okay, as what you say just now, the terms that remember, right? The terms are there. Okay, now I want you to label it using uh -huh. the terms according to the picture given here. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, let us ask, who want to try to answer what is the correct label for the A? There's wow. A here. Oh, oh, what is this? Three of them raised their hand. Yeah, so we see someone. Oh, okay. So we would have, you like uh, to choose? Oh, Mr. the first person. Maybe we can try Irish Umaira. Iris. Yes, so what is Iris. A, Iris. The answer for A is Z God. Is that five? Z God. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Why is that Z God, Teacher David? Is it because I'm seeing sperms there, and then this is the ovum? Yes, okay. when it uh, develops uh, into multiple, uh, what we call that, the eggs develop into multiple, we call that sometimes uh, from one it becomes two, right? Ah, ah that's because I got. Right, okay. well Very done, Iris. Very good, Iris good Sumaira. Answer. So we go to the second one for B. Okay, who want oh, to try? Okay, I saw yeah. Ryan raise his hand first. Okay, Ryan. The answer for B is embryo. Embryo. Ah, is that right? Are you sure, Ryan? It's not a baby? Is it embryo? Okay, I'm going to put it there. Oh. We'll see what teacher Davy says. So, is yes, correct? embryo is the answer. Very good, Ryan. Well done. Well okay, done. let's go to the next. Ah. Okay, who, who want to try for the C? Oh, Irshad. Okay. Oh, Irshad and Shamilia raised their hand. Ah. So, Irshad, what's the answer for C? The answer for C is fetus. 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 Is that right? Before, you just remember, after fetus become what? So we are going to ask. Okay, well done, Ishan. Well That's done, the answer. Ishan. Fetus is the answer. Well Great. Done. Oh, okay, oh. I'm going to close the answer. Yep. You have one more. Okay, who want to try for D? Who want to label it? Yeah, we have Shamilia want to try. Shamilia. Okay, Shamilia, what's the answer for the D? The answer for D is baby. Ah, is that right? Let's see what's the remaining answer. Oh, oh you're right. yeah. <laughs> so you have baby here. Congratulations. Ah, okay. Well done. So we start with Saikot, as you mentioned, did you do yes. And then we progress to the embryo. Mm -hmm. And then and progresses fetus. to a fetus. And of course, progresses to a baby. baby. Wow, yes. do they get marks, did you do Yes. Yeah, ah. please give them reward, each of them. Okay, each of you will be getting a thumbs up. Do you all want a thumbs up? If you want a thumbs up, you have to show me a thumbs up right now. Okay, oh, oh that's only oh, one yes. person. Okay, so, okay, everyone wants a thumbs up. That's good. So I'm going to give each of you a thumbs up. There you go. So we started with yellow. Now we have green thumbs up. Ooh, Shamelia, you are still leading with five thumbs up while everyone has three and four thumbs up. Okay, so I think everyone will be catching up. Did yes, you very good. Very good, everyone. So congratulations for the Shamilia. We still have question after this. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, maybe anyone uh, want to try what is the function of... Uh, mm, mm. Maybe we can recall back that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Function of testis. Huh? Who want to try that? I'm trying to think. Raise Anyone? your hand. Wow, huh? Shamilia again. Ooh. Okay. So what is the function of testis, Shamilia? Shamilia, what is the answer? The function of testis is to produce sperm. Hmm. The function of testis is to produce sperm. Yes, very good, Shamilia. Wow. Okay, well done. Well, okay. done, well done. One more thumbs up for you, Shamilia. Okay. One more thumbs up for, me, for you. Okay. Maybe we can try with... Uh, uh, female reproductive organs. Ah, okay. Okay. Because uh, we haven't asked them about the function. Right. Okay, maybe we can try out. Okay, who want to tell what's the function of vagina? <laughs> function of vagina. Wow, two. Oh. Wow. That was very fast. Who you want to uh, oh, call wow. out? Okay, okay, we're going to try one more time. I'm going to give you a drum roll. The moment we finish drum roll, you raise your hands, okay? Okay, one, two. Oh. <laughs> I think I see. Was it Iris first? Iris, uh, okay. Iris, okay. <laughs> Iris. Iris. <laughs> Iris. The function of the vagina is a channel that receives sperms from the penis. Ah, oh. Is that right? Yes. 
Good. Wow, good job, good Iris. Good job, Iris. And one oh. thumbs up for you. Wow, uh, great, and great. Good job, good job, Iris. There you go. Yeah, she's catching up now <laughs> with the Shamilia. Okay. okay, so we have uh, one more question. One last one? Yeah, last one. Okay. okay maybe we can ask what is the function of a worry? Huh? Oh, okay, there you go. So we have. Ah, it's shut. It's shut. Yes, it's shut. Function of the ovary is the organ that produces ova every month. Wow. Are what? you 100% sure with your answer? Uh, yes, I am sure. Oh, I love the confidence. Well, is that accurate, Teacher Devi? Yes, accurate answer. Well, well done. done. Well Isha. done. So, Very Isha, good. you're getting another thumbs up right here. And everyone, you are all getting lots of thumbs up there. Yes, okay. well yes, done. Hanif, and I'm very happy they managed to answer even we have done that before. And I didn't ask them about the function earlier. Yes. I just I just asked about the uh, female male reproductive organs. Right. Just now I asked about female reproductive organs, still they could answer. They managed yeah. Could they answer, answer very well then, and I'm sure my friends at home as well, you were able to answer, you are paying full attention. And we're now going to take a short break, so don't go anywhere. Continue with that focus. Stay with us on D-Date TV, KPM. <laughs> KPM. Welcome back. Welcome back. You are now watching Didet TV KPM. How? Huh? Why am I singing so much today? Because we are learning science dual language program, and I'm putting a bit of music, a bit of joy to our topic today, which is about the human reproductive system. And of course, with me is Teacher Davy. Who yes. I think enjoy singing as well. Do you, teacher? No, not you don't. <laughs> oh, but we're gonna have some music later. Yes, we are. Yes, yes, we are going to sing a song later, uh -huh. and with the music, right. of course. And uh, before that, we have to learn about the importance of human reproduction. That is right. Okay. So, what are the importance of human reproduction? Yeah. Before I go to the importance, uh, we have learned about female reproductive organs, male reproductive organs, That's right. and uh, fertilization, the process of fertilization. Yes. And the fourth one, we are going to learn about importance. Importance. Okay. Yes. What are the importance? Just now you asked me, right? I did. Okay. Let us uh, see. Look at the uh, our slide here. Okay, the breeding process is important to increase the number of new individuals. Hmm. Okay, if you look through here, the picture given, okay, this is what will happen to the number of these families if Mr. Ahmad and his wife do not breed. Okay, hmm. you, if you look at the C tree map here, it's a tree map. Okay, look, when Inche Ahmad has three children from his marriage to his wife, now his family consists of 12 persons. Wow, from 2 to 12. Yeah. The number of uh, members are increasing, right? So same thing if you look at this. Ah. Okay, this is the flow chart. Flow chart we can see once people got married. Okay, a couple got married and the, uh, the wife got uh, pregnant. Mm -hmm. Okay, and uh, delivered the first baby. Right. Okay. Such a cute and little baby, there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it's a baby, and then they are. Uh, when you can see the picture, she pregnant again. Ah. She got pregnant again. That means. Uh, she got another baby, ah. and now from two of them, now they are four, four in a family, in a right. four members in the family. Okay, this right. is what we call the numbers are increasing during reproduction. Right. I mean, uh, when they reproduction, uh, the numbers are increasing. Now we are going to see what are the importance. Okay, maybe our friends out there they could tell us what are the importance hmm. of the. Human reproduction. Okay, right. maybe we can ask anyone. Ah, well, people at home. So raise yes. your hand. Raise your hand. What are the importance of human reproduction? Yes. Ah. Huh? So I think we saw Ryan first. Ryan. Yes. Ah, tell us Ryan, more. Ryan. Yes. What are the importance of human reproduction? To ensure the continuance. To, to ensure the continuance of the human species. Ah. 
so wow. that we survive. Yes, it can continue the human uh, species. Okay, if not, there's no species. I mean, human will. Okay, later they will answer for that. Okay, uh. ah, all right. Anyone else want to try? That's one. Oh, we have Shamili and Ishad. Okay, who want to answer? Maybe okay. Shamilia. Oh, yes, Shamilia. What are the importance? To ensure human species do not become extinct. Ah, ah, see. So we don't extinct. We don't extinct. Okay, if you look at this slide, okay, we say what will happen to the human species if humans do not reproduce? So at last, we see only older. The, mm. One can see only old old man is set, uh, sitting there. That means that will happen at the end. Then once he's not there, that means a whole human being will be extinct. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that is true. No so, families. No family. No, no children. No kids. No youngsters. No teenagers. No ah. babies. <laughs> ah. So the world will end. That's it. Fin right. I mean, I mean the human species okay. will be extinct. Okay. Okay. Mm. okay. So uh, next, who anyone want to try? What could happen? Wow. They are Ooh. Yes, Should we want give to, try. to Iris? Iris, okay. Iris. Replace replace individuals that died. What is it? Okay. Can, could you repeat your answer, Iris? Replace individuals that died. Oh, oh replace, replace the individuals, individuals that, that died. died. That's interesting. Yes. Yes, very good, Irish. Good answer. Uh, I think that's a very accurate answer. Yes. So once a person is dying or is died, so we can replace with the newborn. Right. So the number of uh, babies right. are increasing. Okay. So that will happen. I think we can give a reward for them. Ah. So that very good answer. Yes. Uh, by first was uh, Ryan. Ryan. Okay. So I've I've put for Irish there, and then we're going to give Ryan. Another yes. thumbs up. Shamelia. And Shamelia. Ah. Uh -huh. Shamelia is still a train going very fast. Leading. Yes. Okay, but everyone's so, catching up. So Isha, you want to try? You have any idea huh. why? Okay, yes. okay. Let's hear it from Isha. Uh, yes, Isha. To increase the number of individuals. Increase the number of individuals. Yes. Huh. Very good. Very good. Well Fair. done, Ryan. Uh, yeah. I mean uh, Isha. So okay. we can have a Reward for him here. Isha gets a thumbs up as well. Can I have my name here, Teacher David? <laughs> I hope to get some thumbs yeah, up. Yeah, sure, as sure. We can I'm put kidding. it down there, Hanif. <laughs> I'm okay. Kidding. All right. So, so I have one question to them as well, uh -huh. Hanif. Okay. Just now we talk about um, Incha Ahmad uh, free, three map, right? So there's uh, one question uh, asked: uh, What will what will happen to the number of these families if Mr. Ahmad and his wife do not breed? Hmm. Huh. Oh, there you oh. go. Ishad is wow, very quick. Wow, so far three of them want to try. Okay, okay I think Ishad raised his hand yes. first. Okay, Ishad, what would happen? There will be no youngsters in the family. No, no youngsters, youngsters in, the in the family. family. What are you trying to say, Ishad? Abang Hanif is not young anymore. <laughs> okay, is that answer accurate, Teacher David? <laughs> yeah, I can accept that answer. Oh, okay. uh, yeah, very good. Well done. And before, uh, once you said uh, there's no youngsters. How about uh, how about the family members? Anyone? Yes, Ryan. Only old people will be left. Only. Only the old people will be left. Old people. Who are the old people there? You mean? Inji Ahmad. Inji Ahmad and his wife. Yes. Only the two couple. I mean, the couples only will be in the family. Okay, okay, no more others. Very good. Very good, Ryan. Well done. Okay, that's a good answer. I'm going to... How about Ani? What do you think? The answer just okay. now. So I'm they... having tears in my eyes crying. At first, we talked about young people. And now, we talk about old people left. Thank you very much. Okay. It's, it's good. Yes. Actually, well, once uh, the, uh, the wife do not breed, so there is no family members. Because just now we said 12 persons. 12 persons because she breed, right? If not, of course, there's no more. I mean, only two of them. At last, that's all. The family that don't have true. any, you know, kills or yeah. any uh, continuous uh, family donor cannot continue. Yeah, no more no. younger ones. And today, Teacher David, we have learned a lot about the human reproduction system. Can we have a conclusion of what we have learned together today? Yes, yes. Okay, we have learned about, okay, people are able to describe the function of male and female reproductive organs and we also uh, learn and I, I hope that people are able to explain the process of fertilization 
until the baby is born and uh, they can able i mean the pupils able to give reason on the importance of reproductive to human so just now they were explaining about that right yes so i'm sure our pupils here managed to get it i'm sure our pupils at home also managed to get it yes. and should we check their marks yeah should we check their marks yeah, how many sure. thumbs up did everyone get okay iris umaira one two three four five, five. wow five thumbs five. up five very good well <laughs> okay. done Ooh, irshad we have one Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. Well done, yes, Irshad. Sir. Okay, Shamilia. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, so we have two people Not getting bad. seven. <laughs> and one more. One, two, three, four, five, six. And Ryan has six. Wow. wow so we have tie. We have a tie. We have two. a tie. Yes. Okay, okay. Irshad and Shamilia. Well done. And everyone. Okay, <laughs> every one of you, I feel very proud. They managed to answer all the questions and I, I believe that those are outside there at home, they could manage to answer this, uh, uh, yeah, this topic, yeah. they could understand this that topic is true. more. And teacher Davy, myself and my friends out there, we are all wondering, we would like to learn more. We want to do more exercises. Where can we do this? Yeah, we can go to Sumberku. There's uh, more exercise you can find in Sumberku. It's a daily mall under KPM. Uh, yes. So as you can see the link on your screen right now, so check out that link, go and study even more and we have actually come to the end of our program and I think all of you have already warmed up your vocals. <coughs> okay, we are ready to sing but of course before we sing we would like to give a huge thanks to our teacher which is teacher Devi Anak Perempuan Govinda Sami, Guru Cemerlang Sains from Sekolah Kebangsaan Dua Taman Selayang Batu Caves. Thank you so much teacher Devi. Yeah. And of course to our peoples online, all of you are brilliant. You all did very well today. We'd like to thank Shamilia, Iris, Ryan and of course Irshad. Give yourself a big hand. Well done. Well, well done. done. So are you ready to sing? Okay, let's get ready to sing and we hope to see you again. Stay tuned with us on d TV KPM. Thank you so much for today and let's sing together. Yeah, let's sing. Organs. There are five health you to remember. There are uterus, ovary, fallop, tube, and vagina. Ovary produce the egg, vagina receive the sperm, fallop, tube, hold them for fertilization. The embryo develops and grow. That the place we call uterus. It becomes fetus, develop until nine months. Testes and pennies, there are many reproductive organs. Testes produce the sperms, pennies transfer the sperms. Female reproductive organs, there are my health you to remember. There are uterus, ovary, fallop, young tumor. Didik TV KPM